have a rock painted with a silhouette of a turtle. I'm going to show you step by step how to. It's the beginning of a series that I'm doing. So come and join me in my studio and let's get on it. Hi everybody and welcome back. I am very excited. I'm going to paint a little scene on this rock. I'm going to do a whole series. I'm going to do Halloween ones, Thanksgiving ones, um, holiday season, you know, Christmas, Hanukkah, whatever. I'm going to do a whole beach set. So first of all, I'm going to clean my stone. These are smooth river stones. I'm going to clean it with alcohol and then I am going to put you on a time lapse while you watch me paint this. dried and now I'm going to paint my little silhouette of a turtle. And turtles? The outline of turtles are really easy to draw. So I'm going to have him swimming up into the light. So you just do a little oval head. And then his little chubby body that kind of tapers off at the end of the shell. Make that a bit bigger. And see these brushes? I was throwing out some stuff the other day and I had one of those old-fashioned beauty boxes and I had tons of these little makeup brushes, eyeliner brushes, which are just fabulous for this. Okay, so I'm drawing his body. I'm going to put his little tail on at the end. And some more paint and his front legs. Little back legs. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and I am planning on doing as I said in the beginning a whole series of little silhouettes on rocks so stay tuned if you haven't already here's his tail if you haven't already hit the subscribe button and I'll give you a little close-up of this. Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to resin this 
and or varnish it and I'll show you the finished product. I've mixed some resin I'm going to cover it with and I decided that I wanted to paint just a few little accents of seaweed on the bottom. Just to add a little bit more interest. Okay, now my resin. I only need a tiny bit of resin. I'm going to apply it with this sponge. Um, I'm going to actually, I'm going to dry this with the hairdryer, come back, and then we'll apply the resin. All dry. And the way I'm going to apply this is almost as if it's a varnish. Just completely seal it and then it will be waterproof and heat proof. So just going around the edges. And because I'm only putting a really, really thin coat it's not going to drip down the side of the stone. And if a tiny bit does, I'm not bothered. Okay. This resin, by the way, is the KS resin, which I'm, I'm kind of liking. Uh, it does dry at a different rate than art resin or um, stone coat countertop, but I am liking it. Let me turn this around. This is because it's so thin, and there won't really be any need to torch it. But I'm going to. There. Easy. So pretty. Or as my. There is a touch of a tiny little bubble. Oh, yes. There we go. How lovely. Once that's dry, I will put it in a table center piece, probably. It's also going to go on my Etsy store along with all my other pieces and all the links are below this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, do so now and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.